This is about a very important part of any fundraising process for a first team. This is fundraising video three, and it's about the ask. Regardless of which FIRST program you're in, you'll want to follow some steps to prepare. You'll want to look at your budget and determine what your team needs. How much money do you need to reach your goals? Be realistic about how much money you may raise. If you sit with your team and make a list of people you know who may contribute and about how much, this may give you a good foundation to start from. And the more you think it through and practice your pitch, the better you'll be able to communicate why you need the support and the better case you'll make. Remember your resource map? This is a great time to use it. Organize your team into different groups on the map and assign responsibilities to each group and each person within each group. You may be assigned to reach out to connect with different resources. A resource is any person, organization, or program that could help you raise money. You may be asked to contact three local business people and pitch your team's needs to your local parent-teacher association. Or maybe you'll be asked to identify four local people with large social media followings. For each resource, develop a needs list. A need could be making a phone call, meeting in person, applying for a grant, or reaching out in another way. At season's end, make sure you spend time reviewing what worked and what didn't. What were your big successes? What didn't work well? What efforts did you make that may have yielded bigger results if they'd been done differently? This has been video three of FIRST Fundraising Toolkit, how to make the ask. Remember, be prepared and have fun.